Konnichiwa mo na my name is Jay. Welcome to our channel, Gen X Jay. Today's video, we are going to do an unboxing and review of the newest products from Mokrio. Mokrio has sent us their H5 Pro Hub and the LS1 temperature sensors. Both of these products are in their LoRa technology. LoRa means long range. I think it's a quite newer protocol, wireless protocol, in which uh, communication between IoT devices uses a antennas which can span great distances. Before we proceed, I would like to give thanks to Mokrio for sending us these products to be reviewed. Without any further ado, let's start the unboxing and review of the newest products from Mokrio, the H5 Pro Hub and the LS1 temperature sensors. Let's start the unboxing and review. On the front part, it states what are the package contents. On the top part, it states what is the name of the sensor kit and hub. Now, let's open the box and check the contents. This is the user manual. Next, let's unwrap the Hub Pro. This is the H5 Pro Hub. It looks very good. Let's proceed to the other contents of the box. Included also is one piece of LoRa antenna. Also, one piece of power brick. Input voltage is 100 to 240 volts AC. Output is 5 volts 1000 milliamperes DC. Also included is one piece of power cord, type A to type C. And finally, two pieces of LS1 temperature sensors. Let's recap on the contents of the box. The user manual, two pieces of LS1 temperature sensors, one piece power cord, one piece power brick, one piece H5 Pro Hub, one piece of LoRa antenna. Let's take a closer look at the H5 Pro Hub. First things first, let's remove the screen protector on the screen. The hub contains a 16-dot LED matrix and an LCD screen. On one side, there is a single side button and a rotary encoder. On the bottom of the hub, there is an anti-slip base. Now, let's proceed on the back part of the hub. First is the power port. It requires a USB Type-C input. Next is the LAN port. It supports 10 Mbps to 100 Mbps wired connection. Finally, the LoRa antenna. It uses 915 MHz for long-range communication. Dimensions of the hub with the antenna attached is 5.04 by 30.83 by 3.77 inches. Weight of the hub is 116 grams. Now, let's proceed on the LS1 temperature sensor. It has a LoRa wireless connection between the sensor and the hub. Range is 1,650 feet or 500 meters with no obstacles in between. Dimension of the sensors is 6.30 by 2.22 by 0.83 inches. Weight of the sensor is 96 grams. It has a waterproof rating of IP66. It uses three pieces of AAA batteries for power. It lasts for around two years according to Mokario. Probe measuring range is from minus 0 0.4 to 131 Fahrenheit or minus 19 to plus 55 degrees Celsius. Now let's do the setup. Using the Mokrio Smart App, add the H5 Hub Pro. Once connected, select whether you want to connect to the internet via wired or wireless. I chose wireless. By the way, it only supports 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi connection. Once connected, add it to a room. And after that, rename the hub if you want to rename it. I decided to rename mine as Mokrio Hub Pro. Also, do not forget to update it to the latest firmware. Now, let's proceed on adding the sensors. Select the plus button on the upper right of the app, then select the LS1 sensor. Just follow the instructions on the screen. Battery is already been checked, so I proceeded to the number 2. Once it is detected, 
and added on the application, it is done and ready to go. Just do the same steps for the other sensor. Let's now check the integrated LCD functions. First, the settings tab. You can view the network and internet settings. Also, the sensor settings. The locale. Inside the locale, time settings and temperature unit can be changed. Display and sound settings can be also be set according to user's preference. Brightness for the dot matrix and the LCD screen can be changed from 50% to 100%. You can also set a sleep mode, in which the set time range is when both of the screens turns off automatically and will only turn on once triggered within the set time range. The LCD has a calendar if the user wants to have an easy visual access to one. Next is my favorite, the weather function. It fetches the current weather data of your location. It displays your current date, location, temperature, wind speed, cloud cover, and humidity. And finally, you can set it to sensor reading. You can set up multiple sensor readings on the LCD screen. Also, on the dot matrix, you can set one temperature sensor reading. I placed the H5 Pro Hub in the center of our house on top of the SwitchBot air purifier table. So the hub makes a perfect clock and weather data center. It also matches the aesthetics of our house. Also, it provides easy access to the data readings of the deployed sensors outside of our house. I think that is it for the unboxing and review part of the Mocrio LoRa Hub H5 Pro and the LoRa Sensor LS1. Let's now proceed on the pros and the cons. Now let's proceed on to the pros and the cons of both the Hub and the two sensors. I will be separating pros and the cons of each product. For the Hub Pro, number one pro for me is that provides real-time data. The LCD functionality provides instant updates. Also, the clock, calendar, and weather functionality. I really like that one, especially the weather one. Now let's go on to the second pro. Since it is using the LoRa technology, the long-range pro, Protocol. Its range is quite far. It's around 1,650 feet or around 500 meters. But that is with no obstacles in between. No obstacles in between the sensor and the hub. Third is that uh, effective alert system. So it has triple alert system. First is the via email. It will it can alert you via email. Second is via application. And third is via, via an audible sound, so the buzzer. So my fourth pro, I think this is my fourth pro, it has a wide compatibility functionality. But I am talking about the Mocrio ecosystem only. Uh, the fifth pro is ease of setup. Setup in your hub is very easy as long as your Wi-Fi router is set into 2.4 gigahertz. Your hub will connect to it quickly and then the setup process will I think takes only below five minutes can you see it already and also I really like the optionality that you can connect to your router via wireless Wi-Fi connection or via wired if you want hardwire it to your network uh, so I think that is it for the pros of the LoRa hub H5 Pro. Now let's proceed on to the cons of it. So number one con of this hub is that dependent only to the Mocrio ecosystem. If you want to connect other sensors or other hubs with this hub, you are unable. So it is just locked in with the Mocrio ecosystem, unfortunately. So hopefully in the near future, uh, Mocrio will add a matter compatibility with their systems so that it, so that it can communicate with other smart home products hopefully I pray Rio, please give your products smart home integrations with other products so I think your ecosystem is very strong robust I think this will be a very good addition to other smart home enthusiasts home setups uh, next con is that it relies too much onto the cloud uh, you can access still the data locally but when the internet is down the full functionality of the hub you cannot use it a third con range limitations earlier on the pro part i said that 
it can reach up to 1,600 feet or 500 meters, but that is without obstacles in between your sensor and your hub. This is a problem, especially when you have a house or a work or a business location or a laboratory that has plenty of obstacles in between your sensor and your hub. Uh, signal will degrade greatly. Now let's proceed on to the fourth con. Since this is a plugged-in device, it has no batteries. It's too reliant with there will be no power then this system will not work at all the last con there is no smart home integration especially for a big three uh, amazon a google assistant siri shortcuts or apple home kit they don't have any integration at all and also to home assistant by the way the other mockrio system the the one that i had reviewed the st5 sensor and the st6 sensor and the partner hub that version you can integrate it with home assistant but unfortunately, the new ones, the LoRa system, that, that especially those who are using the LoRa system, don't know why Mockrio created a new separate app for that one. Because that app, you cannot access it via web page. And that is it for the con for the HY Hub Pro. Let's now proceed to the LS1 sensor. So for the pros of the LS1 sensor, it provides high precision readings. Number two, second pro that I really like is that it's a wide temperature range around minus 0.4 Fahrenheit to positive 131 degree Fahrenheit. Third is that same with the hub, it has a long range connectivity since it uses LoRa technology. Same with the hub, around 1650 feet or 500 meters between the sensor and the hub. Fourth, Pro is durable waterproof design. Since it is IP66 waterproof rating, it can withstand humid and wet environments. So the next pro is the exceptional battery life. It uses three AAA batteries. So according to Mocrio, it can last around two years. The next pro is versatile application. So you can use it anywhere, anything that you want to monitor the temperature. So finally, the form factor, it is compact and robust build quality of mockrio sensors are great so it feels premium so it doesn't feel cheap compared to other sensors in the market now let's go on to the cons number one con it only measures temperature other sensors from other brands here uh, deployed in my house so they have temperature humidity also they have co2 readings the next one is dependency of to the LoRa ecosystem. This sensor will only work with a LoRa compatible hub. My third con for the LS1 sensor is that like the Hub Pro, it has no smart home integration at all. So it cannot connect to Amazon Alexa, cannot connect to Google Assistant or Apple HomeKit. And unfortunately right now it cannot connect. I cannot integrate it with my home assistant. Conclusion. Both the H5 Hub Pro and the LS1 sensor together can deliver a reliable, powerful, and stable monitoring solution for your businesses, your house, or anything under the sun, or anything that you want to monitor the temperature. With advanced uh, features, long-range connectivity, and exceptional durability, it provides seamless control and precise data tracking for both homes and industrial environments alike. I think that is it for the review and unboxing of the newest product from Mockrio. So before we end, if you want to know more about Mockrio, go on to the description box and click on their link. And if you want to purchase these products on Amazon, we'll be providing the links on the description part. I think that is it. See you in the next one. Bye. Peace.